Lawmakers criticized economic officials today over Taiwan's poor first quarter export numbers. While several of the officials had offered a rosy outlook last year, they blamed the sluggish global economy for troubles in Taiwan's export-based economy this year. Du Zijun, when you were economic affairs minister, you promised the economics committee a golden cross in 2015. You said there would be a golden cross every year, which means that growth would be at least 4 percent. Legislator Chen Mingwen was referring to GDP growth of above 4 percent and unemployment of below 4 percent. This prediction is threatened in part by exports of just 93.74 billion NT between January and April, a decline of 6.2 percent compared to the same period in 2013. The National Development Council's monitoring indicators switched from yellow-blue to blue, which suggests a sluggish economy. It was the lowest indicator score in 33 months. The price of petrochemical products has dropped due to the drop in oil cost. We have an export-based economy. When the global economy fails to meet expectations, our exports face challenges. Legislator Gao Jipeng believes that Taiwan's economy is too dependent on a handful of products. If there is no iPhone 7 or 8, what will we do? Electronics account for a large proportion of our exports. In particular, semiconductors are about 22 percent. When asked whether the NT dollar should be devalued to boost exports, Economic Affairs Minister John Dung said monetary policy involved many considerations and that his ministry respected the central bank's decision.